so then me and Jared were like, well, what the hell are we going to talk about? Because, mm. you know, that's all just a bit depressing. And, you it know, is. to be fair, this entire year has been. So we're done with yeah, this. We're, we're done yeah. with this year, right? We've it's, had enough of it. to say sayonara to, uh, <laughs> to 2020 and say, please don't let the door hit your butt on the way out. And why not make some crazy predictions about 2021? Sure, that sounds this like is, a good idea. This is the lifeblood of Blockade, after all. So we should absolutely end the year, potentially, officially, on this note. It makes so much sense. Yes. So that's yeah. what we're going to do. Me and Jared are going to make our predictions for 2021 mm. about pinball in general. Mm -hmm. uh, digital pinball in general, unless, well, at least I'm doing pin. Uh, we haven't discussed this with each other. What we're what we're going to predict? Um, we know we know two of the things. That yeah, just because we figured it was going to be close, we might yeah. overlap, and we didn't want to overlap necessarily. Um, the other three, they're all off record. We're going to be surprising each other. Yes. I think. Yes. <laughs> in this so, segment. So that's what we're going to be doing. We're going to be uh, making our pinball predictions for the year 2021. Uh, the first category is that which we are most confident about, that we're saying you can take this to the bank. And yep. uh, I'm, going to, I'm going to go ahead and go first. And that is, you can take this to the bank, folks. In 2021, I believe Zen will announce at least two licensed William Tables coming out in 2021. I'm not saying two licensed packs. I'm just saying at least two licensed tables, fully licensed right. DMD tables. That is my bold blockade guaranteed stamp. Ta-da! There you go. Lock it in, right? What do you think, Jared? So, Sound, so for me... Does that sound, I mean, a fair... Oh, yeah. I, I think... I reckon you could absolutely take that to the bank. There's going to be two licensed Belly Williams tables. Like you got to remember that like, when when we say licensed, like I had a like when I was going through this process, I had to be really careful about what I picked um, because so many of them are licensed. So it's getting to the point with the Belly Williams tables that there's only a couple left that aren't actually license heavy. Um, so they're going to have to sh uh, like switch into license mode this year for sure. And with their recent acquisition, um, they're going to have the money to do it. Yep. So, you know, the, I think your prediction is very sound and it will absolutely happen. Okay. So, Jared, what is your prediction that we can take to the bank? Okay. I think in 2021, Zen will release at least two Zen original DLC packages based on pop culture franchises. Are you saying beyond Mandalorian that has already been announced? Um, or yes. In, yeah, I mean, yeah, okay. Yeah, I think, you, so we know there's going to be Mandalorian, but we don't know if there's going to be others. I'm predicting there will be others based on that, and there's also going to be one more. Okay. Yeah, so there you go. There we go. All right. Sounds reasonable enough. Uh, Jared, we're going to let you take the next one to start off, too. These are probably going to happen in 2021, but don't hold us to it. Um, it's just we we have a hunch this kind of thing might happen. So, Jared, uh, why don't yep. you take it away on that one? Okay. So, my number two relates to cabinets. And I think in 2021, RK1UP will offer an upgrade PCB for the first wave customers to upgrade their um, uh, cabinets that receiving in February to Wi-Fi supported. Okay. It will probably it will probably be next Christmas, but I think they will. Okay. So mm. this is the bold prediction Jared made a little while ago. Well, no, your bold prediction was that there was also going to be a second screen. But yeah, uh, that's, that was a real bold prediction. <laughs> that was but a I real bold prediction. But this is your more realistic, is... probably uh, happening. Prediction. I think it's plausible given that given that we know that they're already considering wave two, um, and I think that things will move faster okay. than we were originally predicting. Interestingly enough, mine is somewhat similar, but we diverge. So we're going to see potentially who who is right on this because I am predicting mm -hmm. that One Up and Zen they're going to put out a Jurassic Park slash universal pinball uh universal you know the studio 
uh, cabinet. So it'll be the three Jurassic Park tables plus Back to the Future, um, Jaws, and E.T. Oh, yeah. And well, look, that'll be a pretty so that's and what, some fillers. And, I, and, I, and probably. probably some fillers, but it'll be, I believe, a mm. Jurassic Park-themed cab. Um, oh, however, right, yes. I do not believe that there is going to be any change to the hardware specs from what the three that have been announced are going to be. And mm. the only change that will actually happen, if at all, will be that with the Star Wars and Marvel cabs that you'll be able to purchase and load onto the table the remaining titles uh, that are out for those two franchises. And that's it. If you have the the uh, Attack from Mars one, nope, it's just going to be those 10. And I think that by 2021 holiday, uh, you're going to have those four cabs. They're all going to be essentially wave one. Uh, no Wi-Fi, no upgrades whatsoever. That's my prediction. And then based on what they released this year, then you're going to have wave two with potentially like other stuff on it, like maybe the back box, maybe like Wi-Fi. Right. That, I'm just saying that's not going to be in 2021. That's my prediction. I think that's probably, given how disruptive 2021 has been. You mean 2020? Uh, uh, yeah, 2020 has been. I think that's probably fair to say. I think they'll want to really test the market with the ones they've got out and experiment with the hardware and see what they can actually work out and then plan out yeah 2022's line of cabinets based on that so yeah as a as a an ad, not an addendum uh, an addition to this prediction i don't think at games is going to be changing a thing about their legends pinball in 2021 I so, either. Um, mm-hmm. so i literally think that everything that you're seeing released now is going to be the exact same thing through all of 2021 you're not going to see any differences and i believe that even goes to well played um and toy shock i don't think we're seeing that wave two from toy shock uh Uh, no so no i think they unfortunately did in the water with wave two so there is there is an extra prediction but that's just wild speculation um moving on to number three i'll take Mm -hmm. this one first number three uh for our predictions of 2021 uh these would fall into the the hey that'd be nice but come on it's not yeah. really, you know, it's, <laughs> we're, we're, we're kind of stepping out on a limb here. And then Jared has no idea what my prediction here is. And this is it. Yeah. I predict that Zen licenses from Planetary Pinball, the Williams approved updated code that they are coming out with for yeah. Junkyard, Creature, and Roadshow. That's my, it would be really nice, but yeah, I doubt that's going to happen. Yeah. So you're saying that they would actually put that new code into their current builds for those tables? Correct. As an option, <clears throat> uh, it would be in a. It would be. You would have two two choices of of play. Basically, do you want to play with the new code, or do you want to play with the classic code? I'm trying to think, like with the planetary pinball um, ones, I'm trying to remember if they're going to be radically different rule sets to the originals or whether it's going to be more bug fix and minor improvements. To I believe balance. it's bug fixes. I know like with junkyard, it literally makes it so that the, uh, shoot the dog is either chase the dog or shoot the dog only happens like once <laughs> per game. Oh good. That, that's actually an improvement right there. Right. Cause it's <laughs> just a terrible mode. Um, so I mean, I think it, I think it's changes of that nature, uh, things that would probably make the tables a little more fun competitively. Um, mm. you know, so I don't think it's radical rule changes at all. And these are approved by Williams. So it's not just some scattershot fringe code. This has actually gotten the thumbs up. Yeah. You can actually, they're down here in Australia. You can, there's already a reseller selling the ROMs. Yeah. So you can buy fresh ROMs straight to your machine. Your job's done. Yes. But, and again, yeah. would Zen do it? Mm, I don't know. <laughs> They've mm. been made aware. I think they're already kind of going, yeah, yeah, that would be nice themselves. So anyway, that's that's where I come down. Jared, what is your number? What is your would be nice, but come on. Well, look, would be nice, but, but you know, come on. It's a Zen Studios will announce in 2021 that they have partnered with Jersey Jack. 
to reproduce <laughs> their, their earlier, earlier out of production titles in a new standalone pinball platform. I say earlier because Wizard of Oz and what's the other one? Wizard Hobbit. of Oz, dialed in Hobbit. That era is, I think, possible to do. Um, I think something to the order of uh, <laughs> Guns N' Roses is 100% off your rocker crazy <laughs> to do at this stage. Okay. But I think that it would be nice, but come on. Right? <laughs> We're probably not going to have it, but would it be nice? The only reason why I, I really potentially think that that's going to be difficult is you need the second monitor. And there's not enough yeah. real estate on a single monitor to have the whole pinball table and then that whole back glass playing at the same time. Yeah, that is definitely a technical concern. Like they like they would have to radically rethink how that monitor worked. Yeah. Um, because it is so integral to the game. You have so much stuff up on that second monitor. They really have utilized it to maximum effect. Yeah. 